How can the region ensure investors' confidence in light of the social, political, and economic developments of 2011? Coca-Cola actually does business in more than 200 countries, and there are levels of uncertainty in every region around the world. Having said that, though, the quest for dignity that's intensified over the last year is a very positive development for people across the entire Middle East and North Africa. Of course, there are near-term question marks, but companies and investors are going to see this as a strong, progressive step forward for the region's people, economy, and overall outlook. How can the Arab world enhance its labor markets to respond to the agility of its young workforce? The entire region has the opportunity to benefit from a large and growing youth population that's dynamic, very dynamic, uh, resourceful, and highly entrepreneurial. And these ongoing demographic shifts, I believe, can be a powerful, even irresistible tool in helping bring additional economic opportunity and foreign direct investment to the region. How can the region secure affordable water, energy, and food for 300 million people? As worldwide affluence extends to more people and the global middle class expands, resources around the world are going to face near constant pressure. And due to this, the most important areas of innovation in the years ahead are going to be those that are centered around social entrepreneurship and sustainability. Once focused on addressing resource scarcity. And this region is uniquely positioned to lead the way towards positive, sustainable solutions, both on a regional basis as well as on a global basis.